Good morning. Good morning. So I was watching uh, Mac Lethal, and he did 2,000 words. And uh, uh, I'm sorry, he did 1,000 words in two minutes, which was a, which is a new world record. So I'm going to try to do 10,000 words in less than a minute. So we're going to let some people get in here. And then we're going to get that started. We're going to try to set the, the newest world record. Danny, what up, Dammer? Good morning, Danny. I'm going to share this out real quick. All right, I'm back. That was quick. That was my quickest. Bump, 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 bump. I, uh, I left my grinder in the in the uh, in the in the center piece. Mm -hmm. So take that out. Mm -hmm. I can do that. And it's on bone dry too, so you guys go straight to the gas. The yes, the more the morning challenge. <laughs> Good morning. I'm gonna get a KT. All right. It's easy as I Oh, that's dope. That's easy as it's so dope. So people have to get me there. I'm on my on your path. In my direction. Ugh. Even though I can get that discount, it's like okay. No, I don't need to worry about it. Don't say that too soon. Oh my goodness. Good morning. Who's all here this morning? Share it up if you don't mind. Yeah, I'm gonna do one more share. What up, Matt? Good morning, everybody. Good morning. <laughs> what up, bro? Tina, good morning. So we're gonna do ten thousand words in less than a minute, and we're gonna we're gonna wrap the we're gonna wrap ten thousand words in less than a minute. We're gonna set the new world record. It, right now, it's a thousand words in two minutes. And my my word my words are gonna be one hundred percent legible. Good morning, Josh. A <sighs> good morning, everybody. Ten thousand words in a minute. Uh, last night I passed the fuck out. It was all right.
It was all righty. Danny Hansen, hello, Miss Hello. Hey, hello, Mr. Dava. Good morning, Danny. Tell me when you guys are ready for me to get started on the ten thousand rap, uh, ten thousand words in a minute. Ten thousand words in less than a minute. Uh, and I'm gonna smoke one while I do it. Lemon haze and pass the fuck out. Hell yeah, good for you, man. Let's twist this up. All right, we're lighting this bad boy up. Oh yeah, man. My days, my days actually are pretty full now. My days are actually pretty full. So it doesn't seem like you guys care about the ten thousand words. Okay, so I'm cool. I don't have to do it. Nice. No, I'm kidding. Here it is. Ready? I'm gonna start it right now. Ready? Ten thousand words. See, I did it in less than a minute. I killed the game. Killed it. Uh, uh, uh. Killed it. Killed it. I could have went to 100,000. You know what I'm saying? I'll let someone else beat the next level, you know? I'll let someone else get to the next level on this one. If you guys are catching the replay, that's my humor. It's not clickbait. <laughs> but come on in. Since you're here, let's get high. Let's elevate. So blazing 20s, everyone. Can't say it enough. Blazing 20s. <sighs> Right, Scott? Let's smoke, bro. That was a good one, right, Josh? You even witnessed me doing it in less time, huh? You can actually say you witnessed the world record go down. You can say the blazing 20s. 
Oh, so I've been recording. I've been recording hacks. I got some funny ones for you. Like, well, I'm going to tell you uh, just about one that's my favorite. <laughs> Stinky arms. Idea. <laughs> it shows her go over to a bottle of, of vo lemon vodka. Put lemon vodka under your arm. <laughs> Smell like you were in a fucking bar. <laughs> like, like, really? That's your life hack? Huh? Why don't you go take a shower? Put some deodorant on or something. <laughs> go find some vodka. Not alcohol. That shit's funny. So, so we're, we've captured some of these and we already started recording. I'm going to put a compilation together and I'm going to be the narrative voice over it. So this should be fun. This should be fun. What do you think? Uh, <coughs> yeah, no one's asking you to drink it, Josh. This is for a de underarm deodorant. <laughs> He's like, well, I was going to lick her arm, but that means I'd have to drink vodka, and I'm not going to drink her vodka. You know, you know, it makes me want to shout, shout, shout. I need some Jack Daniels for that, bro. <laughs> <laughs> he says, I need some Jack Daniels for that, bro. Oh, nice. Oh, I need to find me a dark chocolate beanie. To go with my, to go with that hoodie. Technically, the green beanies go with all, would go with any color of these hoodies because the green pocket, you know what I'm saying? It makes me want to shout. It makes me want to shout. Put my hands up. Shout. Put my hands up. <sighs> Got to try to match it up, right? Shit's been slow this morning. Was I buffering bad on uh, on Facebook? People were telling me I was buffering bad on Facebook. I need to come out with some new sock designs. I need him to come out with this shirt to match the socks. Broke out with my old Nikes. I'm like, hey, they're matching what I'm wearing, so I'm, I'll wear them today, too. It makes me want to show. My cuticles be drying the fuck up. I gotta soak them or something. Oh, 
I got a lot of computer work to do today. True, and that's dope, bro. Yeah, Facebook is trash. Matt. Well, thank you for sharing that with us, bro. Maybe it's saying that there's a wolf in your life and you're killing it. And they're no it's they're no longer going to be a predator to you. Maybe that's what that that dream is that you don't know it, but there was there was a wolf in your life and you've made moves to get rid of them and you you just don't know it. So the 10,000 words in a minute. Ready? Here it goes. 10,000 words in a minute. See, I just did it. 10,000 words in less than a minute. 10,000 words in less than a minute. Shit, I've done it many of times now. Railroad crossing, look out for the cars. Can you say that without any R's? That, T-H-A-T. -T. Yeah, I absolutely can. Can you say that without any R's? Railroad crossing, look out for the cars. Can you say that without any R's? That, T-H-A-T. Can you? Can you? Can you say that without any Oz? Can you say that without any Oz? I don't think I could say that. T H A T. <laughs> Here's one for you. She's a runner. Okay. I want you to say most three times. Most, most, most. Type the first word that comes to mind. What do you put in a toaster? Damn, Matt, you're killing it. There you go, bread. You put bread in the fucking thing. Waffles. That's fucking an awesome answer. Let go my ego. <laughs> he says, I put an ego in that bitch. Let go my ego. That is an awesome answer. This motherfucker's killing it, Josh. He hasn't been here a couple seconds. He's typed less 10,000 words in less than a minute. He's brought waffles to the party. Oh, shit. Josh is breaking out with the biscuits and gravy. Oh, you, you, your fucking waffles just died, dude. Your waffles just died, bro. Oh, he came back with the grilled cheese. <laughs> you don't have to put that bitch sideways people that's a fantasy you do not have to put that shit sideways you want a hey, you want to make the perfect toaster grilled uh grilled cheese without no gr without no motherfucking grease this is how you do it you put the toast in the toaster you toast it you put that bitch ready to, to come out nice and golden. You get the cheese ready. As soon as it comes out, you put the cheese on it, boom. Put it on the plate, throw it in the microwave, 10 seconds. 10 seconds, you pull it out, boom. That bitch is extra crispy on both sides, and you got the cheesy. <laughs> Mm. 
That's how you do that one. Or if you absolutely <laughs> corned beef ass and eggs sausage for the win. <laughs> hey, uh, another thing you could do is toast both sides, put your cheese in there, smash them together and stick it back in the toaster just enough to warm it some more. And that will do it too without having to worry about it dripping inside the toaster. All right, give me a second. Let me get something to drink. I'll be right back. Ugh. Bye, guys. Have a great day. All right, sorry about that. Everybody, thank you for chilling and waiting for me to come back. Appreciate that. <coughs> Tina, good morning. Good morning, everybody. So, Tina, did you understand what I was saying about the website? About the theme that the that whoever chose that theme chose? I'm a space case today. Ain't no thing but a chicken wing. Walk, 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 chicken wing. Yeah.
ain't no thing but a chicken wing. 10,000 words in less than a minute. Oh, shit. I told you you could understand every word I said, too. All right, find a road and get stoned like a gravel road. We have to put that on a shirt sometime. Get stoned like a gravel road. What you think about that, Josh, huh? Would that be great? Get stoned like a gravel road. Come on, everybody. Let's get stoned like a gravel road. For reals, that's what we do around here, right? My wife went and burned some tortillas. House smells like a tortilla factory. Ay, 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 ay. Hasta la huevo. Like a gravel road. Still in my song. What song is that? What song did I steal? And monetize. Huh? <coughs> what? 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 What song? Oh, the tortilla shop. <laughs> He's like, I copyrighted that like years ago, bro. <laughs> On my way. Hey, when I was in New Mexico... There was a place, a tortilla factory, like literally right down from where I was staying. And oh my God, the smell in the morning was just, oh, I was in love. I was like, ah, the smell of tortillas cooking fresh in the oven. Oh my God, it was. I also grew up next to Wholesome Bread. Have you guys ever heard of Wholesome Bread? I grew up next to that. And uh, man, you'd smell the, the bread going off over there. So I kind of enjoy the smell of it, you know. It's not often you get that that smell. I think it's spelled a little different, but yeah, wholesome bread. I think it's H O L S O M, wholesome. I could be wrong. Oh, I get all the smells, bro. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, I've done pizza. I worked at a croissant place once. That was kind of interesting, making croissants. I had no idea how many times they take this, like, baker would take, would take baking sheets, okay? And the night before, melt a bunch of butter in baking sheets with parchment paper and he would melt like 60 sheets of of butter and then after they would melt we had to put them in the walk-in for uh, refrigerator and then the next day we would come and pop the the parchment paper 
and we would have these thin little sheets of butter. And then he would make the dough. He would roll the dough out, put a sheet of butter there, roll the dough over it, and, and blend the two together. Stretch it out, put another sheet of butter, and roll it. And he just kept doing that process until he went through all kinds of butter. And, man, I tell you what, when, when we cooked up those croissants, they flaked up. They were like, phew, they were like bomb. I was like, wow, that's how this shit's done? That is kind of neat, huh? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Nom, 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 right? Oh, yeah. Cinnamon rolls will light a room up. Just like uh, making some can of butter. Just like making some can of butter. And we got 10 more minutes and I got to I got to clock out and go to work. It's crazy having a schedule now when you haven't been used to a schedule. <laughs> I guess I should have always had myself on some type of a schedule. I, mean, I had a smoke schedule. The bread proofer and then the bread oven to cook them. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, that's dope. That is dope, dope, dope. Yeah, I got to build databases today. But I got to go shower first. Yeah, I've already had mine in this morning. It was good. It was nice. It was good and nice. Yeah. That sounds kind of fun, Dabber. Right, if you're like fucking living in the Matrix. I know, the database part. I got to build a bunch of products for databases, for a database. The one thing nice about being able to do it is that I can do it from home and he's going to let me do it from home so I can jam out, I can smoke, I can fucking rock this room out while I'm sitting there ah, doing a database. Ah. Shannon, what up? So that's the cool part. <sighs> yeah, the, it is repetitive work, but I'm trying to build an Excel spreadsheet. So, so you know, it's repetitive to some sh to some degree, but you know how tables are. I could sit there and just drag a set of us. Uh, a set of information all the way down. But when the product information becomes very variable, then I have to sit there and it becomes tedious, you know? So it is what it is. And it ain't no more. Hey, hey, Matt, though, I didn't realize being a pain in the ass in school would actually prepare me for the future. Ready? <laughs> I will not dis uh, I will not uh, uh, be disruptive in class. I will not be disruptive in class. I will not be disruptive in class. I will not be disruptive in class. What is it? What am I doing? I'm fucking entering into a database. I will not be disruptive in class. I will not be disruptive in class. I will. Not I was preparing myself for the future. They thought that I was. They were teaching me a lesson. Nope. I'm fucking going for the big bucks, baby. 
<laughs> data processing. <laughs> I was ready from a teenager's age. <laughs> right, Matt? You know that shit's true. <laughs> You know that shit's true. Have a great day, babe. Oh. Shannon, good morning, Deborah Nation, sister for life, brother for life. Deborah Nation for life. Yeah, that shit's funny. Where are those kids today? They're data processors. They seem to have a natural knack for putting in the same stuff multiple times. Uh, I will not be disruptive in class one. I will not be disruptive in class two. I will not be disruptive in class three. I will not be disruptive in class four. On an Excel spreadsheet, I will not be disruptive in class one. Drag that down, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Drag this one down. Boy, I want to be disruptive in class. Boom, boom, boom. Done. Okay, ma'am. I did it 180 times. That's actually creative. I'm going to say that to my boss. Yeah, so that's data processing, huh? That's entering in products on the back end of a website. <laughs> I always knew that, that that would be good for something. I will not be disruptive in class. Number one. I don't know data. See, this is where it becomes difficult. I will not be disruptive in class. Uh, size large, color blue. I will not be disruptive in class. Size small, color yellow. I will not be disruptive in class. Size extra large, uh, pink. I will not be disruptive in class. Size, you know, that's when it becomes a fucking, you, you know, that's when it becomes annoying, okay? Right, Matt? <laughs> purple, 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 purple. Yeah, they didn't know they were teaching me for web design. Andy, babe, love you. Have a great day. Yeah, they had no idea they were preparing me for the future. Data processing is your future. Pound the keyboards and pound it well, I say. Let the data processor in you come out. Don't go and hide because it's easier. Let the data processor in you shine. Oh, oh. Yeah, I'm about to be out of here in two minutes myself. I got to get going at eight at the top of the hour. Data processing BS. I see six likes and five views. <sighs> Matt says he sees seven, so yeah. Oh, Becky, good morning. You coming in in the last minute of the show. Good morning. We got two minutes left, and I'm out of here. Oh, well, I guess we got one minute left. Well, I see my shit's fucked up. That's funny. 
I'm getting a little better connection. Dope. Y'all have a great day. That's cool. I still got to say good morning. Yes, you did. Good morning, Becky. One love, one love. All right, everyone. Thank you guys for chilling and hanging out with me this morning. You guys fucking rock. Go game this world. Go have a blast. You know, get the shit you need to get done. Do it dabber style. Get dab money. You know what I mean? One love, everybody. Have a blessed and awesome day. Stay blessed. Stay medicated. Always stay elevated and always